All right, two local restaurants with low health inspection grades this week. Unfortunately, yeah. uh, here is Don Dare to tell you what's going on with Food for Thought. There are several restaurants that have been reinspected since last week, but first, the lowest health inspection scores of this week. In East Knoxville, Chandler's Deli, 3101 Magnolia Avenue, receives a 74. The health department considers a score below 70 as unsanitary. At Chandler's Deli, steak and gravy were at 75 degrees. That's too cold. Hot food is supposed to be at 135 or warmer to slow bacteria growth. At the frying station, food pans and fryer baskets were left soaking in food grease. Instead, they should have been cleaned and sanitized in the big three compartment sink, not left in food grease. The inspector writes, no date marking system was in place for ready to eat food. Dates of first use are required. No guessing is allowed at restaurants. The inspector has returned to Chandler's Deli. The original grade of 74 has been upgraded to a 94. In West Knoxville, the Soup Kitchen Express, 9222 Kingston Pike, receives a 74, a passing grade. Here are the violations. The cook was observed preparing and touching raw meat, but then started handling ready-to-eat food without washing his hands first. Raw meat is filled with bacteria. The person in charge was unaware of employee illness symptoms. However, the manager is required to know them. This next violation may not seem like a big deal to you. When the inspector checked the can opener, it was dirty. It had food debris on it. The can opener is required to be cleaned and sanitized after each use. The Soup Kitchen Express has been checked again. The initial grade of 74 is now a 93. Last week, s, s Cafeteria, 4808 Kingston Pike, had a failing grade of 69. It's been re-inspected. The new grade is an 88. Bruno's Pizzeria, 6907 Kingston Pike, last week scored a 70, a passing grade. The inspector has returned. The reinspected score is now an 85. Well, no reinspections are necessary at the top restaurants of the week. They're all perfect. And here are the best grades of the week. In Gatlinburg, Flapjack's Pancake, cabin number three on the parkway, 100. Same grade, 100 for the Mountain Edge Grill, also on the parkway in Gatlinburg. In Seymour, Domino's Pizza on Chapman Highway, 100. In Morristown, Hillbilly Cabin, the one on McCrary Drive, 100. The Cracker Barrel in Alcoa, Perfecto. In Clinton, the Bojangles on Charles Seavers Boulevard, 100. The Pizza Hut in Oak Ridge on the Turnpike scores 100. Crystal, the one in Halls on Maynardville Highway, 100. Same grade 100 for the Alliance Brewing Company on Sevier Avenue in Knoxville. Wendy's, the one on Asheville Highway in Knoxville, 100. The Casual Pint in Fountain City scores 100. And in Powell, Top Flight Barbecue on West Emory Road, 100. Those are excellent grades at restaurants that serve lots of customers. Don Dare covering Food for Thought. All right, Don, thank you so much. And if you'd like to look over all of this week's health inspection scores for yourself, we made it easy for you to do just that. They're under the As Seen On section of WATE.com.